What is going on guys, Flawless here, and today I'm bringing you guys a brand new video that I've been excited to make ever since I ever started to play this game. It's called Tentem. So this is a Pokemon clone per se, but what appeals to me about this game, I was watching some videos on it, I didn't even know this game's existence whatsoever, and as you guys know, I do upload Pokemon videos, and I am a very big fan of the Pokemon art style and just the way the game feels, not to mention the Pokemons themselves, which are all very unique. This game brings a lot more to the table than your traditional Pokemon clone. I was astounded by the amount of color and diversity in this game. The world, as far as I've seen it, because I just started to play the game not too long ago, so this is kind of like a first impressions video. I am by no means a veteran in this game. I just started playing maybe have about an hour and a half of playtime so i kind of want to break down the things that i like and the things that i don't like about this game so far in my playthrough so right off the bat as soon as i start since this is an online game most of the names that i wanted to pick were actually taken so that was a little bit upsetting and the character customization once you start i tried to make a male character for myself and they just ended up all looking the same so i just ended up doing a random character this is what i got so it's not a big deal i will be able to customize it later down the line apparently the cosmetics are incredibly expensive in this game for some reason uh but you can get those through grinding so it's not a big deal but it kind of falls around the same premise as pokemon you gotta catch pokemon you battle trainers you do kind of like gym leaders but i like the diversity in terms of the characters you can find in this game and the trainers that you actually find to battle that normally in pokemon they're very easy and anybody can kind of breeze through them and it's very unlikely to lose any of them i actually lost my first battle to playing against these characters now given it is my first time playing this video game and i have no clue what i'm doing it just shows you that it's kind of like no mercy like they won't take it easy on you even if you're a new player so it's definitely cool in that aspect where you will lose a lot of games to computers essentially computer trainers that's exactly what it is but the amount of diversity in characters has me astounded because they all have like sure they're not creatures that you've never seen before some of them actually are some of their designs are absolutely insane i'm in love with the way the game looks in graphics in my opinion gets an absolute 10 out of 10 because i'm just a fan of this cartoony type of art style with a lot of vibrant colors that's what makes me a big fan of pokemon they're always full of color light and it's a very vibrant type of game and that's what i'm into but this game brings a lot to the table and i can't wait to bring you guys more videos but for now this has been my first opinions i highly recommend this game if you guys can get your hands on it it's definitely an incredible game and i highly highly recommend it if you're into pokemon clones or two like where everything is exactly like pokemon it's kind of like pokemon with a twist and the twist and it has a bunch of interesting features like the battles you're never going to get 1v1 battles it's always going to be team battles and the stamina system is really cool because for you to use the ability all you need is stamina and you regenerate some stamina per match but each character has a certain amount of stamina and and each move the stronger the move is the more stamina it consumes and you can still use the move without stamina but it'll take a big chunk out of your health pool so i can see the competitive scene for this game to be quite hype and there will be a lot of strategy and risk and reward plays where if you don't have the stamina to pull off a move and you sacrifice your health you might be able to win the game there's definitely a lot of things that could happen with this game and i'm very excited to see what kind of dlc they end up coming with if they do release some i definitely love to see some character customization which is what i see that lacks the most in this game like they could bring a dlc to customize your character and customize your house a little bit more a ton of things can be done with this game and i'm really excited let me know in the comment section below if you guys have played this game i'm playing this on the nintendo switch right now i'll see you guys in the next video take care I need you, I need you.